Hey, this is Joshua Slack. I'm here to show you some of the interesting things we've done in the terrain system for Argo 3D 0.6. So today's example is a procedurally generated terrain. And basically that means that the terrain's height map and texture information that you're seeing here is completely generated from a math function, which means that we can go on forever and ever and we'll never see the end of the world. The fidelity of the terrain's texture is actually a function of the procedural formula that we're using. So you can have something that's higher grain fidelity or lower based on the data that you provide. One of the more advanced technologies in the Argo 3D terrain system is our use of geometry clip maps and texture clip maps. And basically that allows us to have a dynamic level of detail on the terrain. And as you move your camera around, that those levels of detail follow you. And that's true for both the geometry, as you saw there, and the terrain texture, as we're showing through debug mode here. These techniques allow us to have a high constant frame rate, no matter where you're looking on the terrain, with frame rates of hundreds of frames per second or more not uncommon. The terrain system is technically part of the Arta 3D 0.6 release, which should be out fairly soon. But you can come check it out at arta3d.com through the nightly builds or a subversion. That wraps up the Art of 3D Terrain demo. I hope you'll check us out at art3d.com.